Good day, it's Mirko Grillini again from the Hunter Valley in Australia, 150 k's north of Sydney. We are in this beautiful wine and food region here and I'm going to cook a beautiful risotto. It's a bit Polish today and it's perfect for a risotto with the prawns. Now, the prawns are a very delicate seafood to cook uh, and the risotto normally takes about 20 minutes to, to be ready. Therefore, it's best not to put the prawns inside the risotto from the beginning. Therefore, we're going to saute them first. Now, I have some uh, beautiful olive oil here, which has been already heated. And I have some fresh prawns that I'm just going to put in. Fantastic. Now, we will need to put garlic in it as well. Garlic and seafood work really well every time. The only problem that we have is that if we put garlic now, it will start burning and overpower the flavor of uh, the prawns. Therefore, we add a little bit of moisture in there and flavor, and we splash it with a little bit of this beautiful Hunter Valley Chardonnay. Fantastic. Now we can put the garlic and a little bit of parsley. Fantastic. They smell fantastic. Here we are. I'm just going to turn the flame a bit lower and let them simmer. Put a little bit of more olive oil in here and let it go for a while. I won't salt it yet. In here we have some uh, olive oil ready for the onion. This is how we start the risotto. We need to get the onion very soft. Keep stirring it. Once again, we don't want to burn anything. This is the part that will flavor all the dish. Once the onion starts slightly changing color there and is softened, we use some risotto. We are using arborio today. There's another quality of uh, rice which is perfect for uh, the risotto and it's called Yalone Nano, but it's not available everywhere. Here we are. Fantastic. Now, this part is important. We need to coat all the rice with the, the onion and the olive oil. All the flavor needs to be part of the dish. Once again, a splash of Chardonnay. And we just let it evaporate. Excellent. All the wine evaporated, now we have the perfect time to put chicken stock. Chicken stock needs to be hot, and this just came out of the flame. And we just cover the rice completely, and then never stop stirring until the very end. <laughs> It's just been over 15 minutes now, and it's, we are there, it's almost there. We can't let it go too far. I'm just gonna stop stirring for a quick second just to get the prawns and just pour them in here. All the juice, the oil, and everything goes in here. Switch off the fire and then stir it again. Let's go and plate it. Fantastic. Look, it sits up perfectly. That's what you want. You don't want to exaggerate with the portion of the rice and make sure that all the prawns are actually sitting in there. And the last one. All done. Once again, on Food Facts, Mirko Grillini from the Hunter Valley in Australia. Ciao.